we have learned that there is nothing called absolute rest nothing in the universe is at absolute rest rest or motion is always relative to some observer motion is relative to decide whether an object is at rest or it is moving we need to fix an observer first now let us consider the sun and the earth this is the sun and science tells us the earth is going around the sun now this is with respect to whom this is with respect to an observer on the sun if there is an observer on the sun that observer will see the earth going around the sun in approximately 365.25 days so this motion of the earth is with respect to the sun with respect to an observer on the sun but what about an observer on the earth an observer on the earth sees the sun going around the earth once in 24 hours this is what we see right and therefore with respect to an observer on the earth the sun is going around the earth and with respect to an observer on the sun the earth is going around the sun and both these statements are correct because motion is relative right now if both are correct then why did scientist spend so much of their time and energy to prove that the earth goes around the sun why to understand this let us consider one more situation a train is there on a railway platform so this is the train this is the platform we have two observers one observer is on the platform and other observer is on the train the train is moving now with respect to the observer on the platform the train is moving forward so that's what that observer will say but the observer on the train will feel that the platform is going backward so with respect to him that is also correct now question arises what is actually moving the train or the platform how can we say that the train is actually moving suppose a person is born in the train he lives all his life in the train and he says the train does not move the platform and the outside world moves now can we prove to him that actually the train is moving he is not going to come out of the train he cannot bring him out and show okay look train is moving he is going to remain in the train he is trapped in the train and we have to prove to him that the train is actually moving and not the platform can we do that as long as the train is moving with uniform velocity there is no way we can prove to him that the train is moving and not the platform but the moment the train accelerates either the driver applies brakes or he suddenly starts the train then person in the train will fall not a person not the person on the platform so therefore the train is moving remember 
motion is relative but acceleration is absolute when the train accelerates person in the train is going to fall not the person on the platform and that tells us the train is moving and not the platform same way we can measure the acceleration of the earth we can feel the acceleration of the earth and therefore the earth is moving and not the sun actually the sun is moving also okay but in this situation when we are considering the earth and the sun the earth is moving around the sun and sun is not moving around the earth okay that is because we can measure and feel the acceleration of the earth this is how we assign motion to a body